Well, Alexis is uh, here now uh, with the weather. And Alexis, some mild weather on the way, but a big change after that in the offing, I guess. Yes, turning very mild Thursday, Friday, but very cold come Sunday. But, Tom, it's all about the sunrises. Let's take a look at them. Victoria Timms took this shot of the sunrise in Brill this morning. And Brill it is indeed. Look at this otherworldly wow. shot of Lymington by Ben Slater. Sunrise and moonset in one frame. Oh, that's brilliant. And here's the sunrise from Gosport, photographed by Maureen Coles. So today we had a good deal of cloud to end the day and we will continue to see a lot of cloud for the start of tonight. Today, some sunshine though in some places. This is West Sussex, photographed by one of our weather watchers. But it was a cloudy affair for those in Poole in Dorset, photographed by Robin Redbreast. So tomorrow there will be more in the way of sunshine widely. It's a cooler feeling day. Temperatures are around their seasonal average. Increasing cloud in some areas, so there will be varying amounts of cloud. Patchy rain is a possible overnight tonight for eastern areas that will clear away the skies will clear in a few places which may trigger some mist and fog patches to form temperatures tonight will drop away to around four to five degrees so turning fresh out in the countryside in some areas so tomorrow there will be a lot more sunshine maybe some mist and fog patches initially which will burn away sunny spells through the course of the day staying dry as well there will be slightly more cloud arriving for western areas later on but in the sunshine temperatures will be up to around 11 to 12 12 degrees. So on the inshore waters tomorrow between Selsey Bill and Lyme Regis, the winds are northwesterly three or four, backing westerly four and the sea state is smooth or slight. So tomorrow night, the skies will remain clear for many places, although temperatures stay above freezing, very similar to tonight. Once again, we could see some mist and fog patches with a low of around four degrees. So we start the day on Thursday with some cloud. Through the course of the day, the cloud will come and go. It's coming in from the mild Atlantic air, and that means we'll see some patchy cloud and some sunny spells during the course of the day. But milder air, it's a tropical maritime air mass originating from the tropics and coming across the sea, hence the maritime name. And so we are going to see a fair amount of cloud, but also some sunshine at times. Here's the outlook for the rest of the week. Uh, we'll have a lot of dry weather for the rest of the week. Very mild temperatures come Thursday and Friday, maybe up to around 14, even 15 degrees. But there will be some sunshine. It looks a bit pessimistic on the outlook here, but we will see the cloud break up Thursday, Friday, and even into the weekend, Saturday and also Sunday. But look at that. Temperatures take a drop come Sunday, down to around 8 degrees. So normally at this time of year, we have hives of around 10 to 11 degrees. So that's below the seasonal average. And next week, with high pressure dominating, it will feel crisp with frosts overnight. Tom. Alexis, thanks very much. The jet stream up to its old tricks again, is yes, it? Yes, it is. Now, have you ever wondered what a kelp conference is all about? OK, no, yes, I'm, I'm wondering. It's intrigued? Well, tune in tomorrow and we can find out more. Uh, that's uh, how it's looking tonight. Thanks for being there. We're back at 10.25. We'll see you then. Bye-bye for now. Good night. <laughs>